employee reviews today. Employee review day. Apparently I'm on the hot seat today. They can hit me with everything they've got. I'm so nervous. <laughs> Should I be nervous? Somehow I think we'll make it through. I got a maid in the shade. If Clark reviews me, all I gotta do is talk sports. If Kelly has me in her office, no worry. I'll flash this bad boy. If he tries that pretty boy smile on me one more time, I'm gonna roll my eyes right in his face. It's gonna look something like this. It's called idiosyncratic Raider effect. See, for me, it's not just about performance reviews being useless. I actually looked up the psychology behind it. To put in simple English, people are lousy at rating other people. He acts like I'm, I'm out to get him. I mean, it's, it's like he's always looking over his shoulder for the workday police. I have in my possession all the information that will absolve me from any of the possible 67 fractions that I have committed. Did you know that 60% of your review has more to do with the rater than how the ratee actually performed? So go ahead and drop down the root word of idiosyncratic and you get this equation. This is my fourth cup. <gasps> Um, yeah, performance reviews are kind of like lie detector tests. The more you hop yourself up on caffeine, they can't tell if you're lying. <laughs> I've been through this a million times. Sometimes I come out unscathed, and other times I come out with a black eye. But at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter because there's one sure thing. Employee reviews are garbage. One person's opinion. They might as well say, what have you done for me lately? I mean, it's not like the bosses care about anything that happened over a week ago. It's a popularity contest. And let's face it, I'm no cheerleader. Rah, rah, ree, kick him in the knee. I don't even know why we do employee reviews. It's like some pointless ritual. The top brass say have performance reviews. So we follow orders. And then work goes on just the way it was before.